Hello, beautiful people. Welcome to Are We There Yet? My name is Cheryl, and I appreciate you stopping by, spending a little time with me. I hope you're having a beautiful day. It's a beautiful day here, as usual, in the mountains. It's it's cold, though, but it's fall is here in all its glory. It is absolutely beautiful. The leaves are, some of them are still hanging on the trees, but the majority of them are on the ground, and you can walk through them and just crunch the leaves under your feet, and it's just... It's just a beautiful time to be alive. The air is fresh and clean and chilly, and it's it's just wonderful. So I hope you're enjoying your fall so far, and I hope you're enjoying your spring if you're in the Southern Hemisphere. But I am here with a Timu haul. I have some things that I'd like to share with you, some things I'm very happy about and some things not so much, but we'll get, we'll dive into this and get started. So is I have my Timu Boho Burgundy Brown Pink Tan Color shirt on, which I love. I've got these heart shaped kind of boho ish earrings on. My gold headband from Timu. This ring is from Timu, which I love. It's one of my favorites. And then the nails. <clears throat> now, these nails were a about this color this tan, you know, and I put them on, they were matte, they're, they're, they weren't glossy, they're, they're matte, I got them in one of those boxes that has like 288 nails in it, just different, different, uh, like nine or 12 different colors, and I put them on, and it looked like I didn't have fingernails, it looked like <laughs> they were about the same color as my skin, and it looked like my skin just went straight to my, so I was like, no, I, it's not flattering at all, so I just painted them, so I just painted over them, so the nails are from Timu, but the color is from a bottle. So that's that. And while I'm talking about nails, I'd like to share with you a tip that I learned from Retro Susie. I'll link her below. If you're not watching her channel, go over and pay her a visit. She's a sweetheart. I, I love her hauls. But she mentioned that she had bought these little boxes, plastic boxes with compartments, and I already bought a couple of them for different things, like earrings and, and things like that, but she bought them to put her nails in. You know, absolutely amazing idea. I, I took all those boxes that each set of nails come in and I took the nails and just put them in one of these little compartments and I kind of arranged them the way I wanted them arranged. And the piles, the stacks, the rows of boxes was condensed to this. And and I, I, I'm just over the moon with this. So easy, you can see them. You know, it, it's at a glance, you don't have to fish through 75 boxes. It's coming out of my mouth. <laughs> But that is the best idea. So thank you, Susie, for sharing that. I really appreciate it. So I have some accessories here. I have some jewelry. I have uh, just a couple odds and ends. So we'll get started. I don't know if you remember, but um, if you've been watching my channel, I, I bought some patterned thicker socks uh, that, that were supposed to be men's socks. And when I got them, they were size 6 to 10. I couldn't even get them on my foot. I, I was thinking about keeping them, but they wouldn't even fit me. So if they're not going to fit me, they're not going to fit any man that I know, you know. So I, I think those were really kid socks. I do. And and I do have somebody I can give them to um, with a smaller foot. But still, you know, they're supposed to be men's socks. But I did find these, and these are wonderful, and I love them. These are, there's five pair, and they're they're all different patterns, but these are fabulous to wear under boots and they fit perfectly they feel good they've got a, a stretchy cuff on them I've, I've tried them on to make sure they fit and they do they're just wonderful look at this isn't that cute but five pair and uh, you know as usual the prices will be on the screen I'm a little out of practice <laughs> but this is pretty but under boots you can't beat it look just really cute and they're like I said they're soft and they're you know I I don't I'm a diabetic so I um I have to not an insulin diabetic but I, I um I am a diabetic and I do have to be careful of my feet and nothing too constricting nothing too you know it's going to cut my circulation off so 
I was very happy with these. They're not, because I have to watch with socks. If they're too tight, you know, I mean, they, they just literally cut my circulation off. But I do like those. So, and it, it was a good deal. It was a good deal. <laughs> What's that come from? It was a good deal. So I saw this and I thought, you know, we get uh, some years, like last year was not a, a brutal winter at all. We, we got one snow, I think, out of the whole season one snow and usually we get feet literally of snow not at the same time but you know we get several good deep snows but we didn't last year so this year I'm expecting some snow but I saw this and I thought that is just really cute it it like goes oh just your face shows this goes over over your nose if you want and over you know over here so you put that on and then it's got this <laughs> little ball on the top but this thing is so soft it is so soft and it's going to be extremely warm to wear out in the snow when I go play in it it's got a, um, a band of like this faux fur around it and the rest is just like a uh, really thick fleece but it's it's really nice yeah I like this this comes in different colors I like it this, I thought, this reminded me of a certain brand that I won't mention because we all know I've gotten in trouble for that before. But this uh, this plaid, I love the colors of it. And I've got a purse that will, it will match perfectly with my purse. So, yeah, this is a scarf and it's, uh, it's just, just a regular scarf. But I really like this. There are different patterns of this too. It's not very thick. It's just a thin scarf, so it would be perfect to wear over, you know, a turtleneck or, you know, a blouse inside and then, you know, under your under your coat and around your neck um, and, you know, outside. It's got a little fringe on it. So I like that. This one I fell in love with. Okay, so this is just a knitted scarf, but watch, watch, what, watch what happens. It's got this little you can see it right there this little band on it so I'm going to take this and take this end of it opposite the band and I'm going to put that end in here and just push it through there's there's not many you know it's not it's not very far it's not like stringing a uh, drawstring on a pair of sweatpants it's just, it's just uh just small you can reach up in there and grab it and pull it and then you just kind of scrunch it up. But look, this goes around your neck and then it's like this. And it lays on, um, on your chest. You could make it, make it look pretty and just lay on your chest like that. Isn't that pretty? I ordered another one of these. I think they're they're fabulous. You can make it as tight or as loose as you want it. And I, I ordered a black and white one too. And they have burgundy. I think there's a blue one. But isn't that neat? And it's knitted. You know, it's knitted. It's it's really soft. So it's going to be very comfortable to wear. But I think that's just a trick, isn't it? It's cool. And then when you're not wearing it, you can fold it flat. It's really nice. So, <laughs> you know, I'm a little nervous about saying the name of these, but when uh, when I was growing up, we had these little dickies that we wore under sweaters. And what they are is just a faux collar, and it goes down, and it makes it look like you've got a shirt on under, under a sweater. And I saw these on Timu, and I thought, well, I want to, but they're very thin, they're, I mean, they're literally thin as they can be. They're just, let's see, 100% polyester. But, you know, it's still, if you've got a really, really thick sweater and you don't want anything, you know, binding you underneath, or you don't want a turtleneck, you can put these on, you know, and just, just put the sweater over it and it looks like there's a shirt on underneath. So I got that color and then I got the white. So, you know, they are what they are. They're just little faux collars. 
to wear under shirts. Not expensive at all. Nice. I also got, I also got these uh, gloves, and I'm I'm very pleased with these gloves. You know, gloves are hit or miss, and these were these are really nice. I got the black ones, and then they've got the finger tips that you can, you know, use your phone with it. But these are nice and thick. They're very comfortable. They're very nice gloves. I'm very pleased with these. I'm picky about my gloves because, you know, sometimes you can get, the, if they're not going to keep your hands warm, what's the point, right? And these, these are, they're, they're stylish and they're functional and they're very thick. So I'm pleased with them. Okay, let's move on to some different things. I have this little fella. This is a gift, but I wanted to show him to you because he's so stinking cute. Look, this is the little bunny rabbit. That light is stark in it, but he's got little, his, his eyes are under there. He's got little eyes, but he is so fluffy and so soft. And his little, look at his little paw and his big floppy. Too stinking cute. I can't with this. And it's, oh gosh, it feels so good. So soft. I don't know when I'm going to stop. I'm going to learn my lesson about these 10 signs from Timu because they come beat all to crap. And this was no exception, but this is the Anne of Green Gables quote. I'm so glad I live in a world where there are Octobers. It's got these really pretty, but it's beat all to heck. It's, it's dented and look at that. I mean, they, they, sh some of the companies now will put them in cardboard and, you know, protect them somewhat. They still get dinged up. But some just stick them in there with, with soft stuff and, you know, that's all she wrote. So I wanted to share these with you. And I cannot get enough of these. And I'm hoping that they'll do some Christmas ones. But I got a... I have to look at the reflection. I'm going to have to show you a picture. This is a stemless wine glass, and this is what it looks like. And it says Cat Mom, and it's pink. And I already have one that says, I'll wine all I want, I'm retired. <laughs> they have that one. Then they have the one that says Cat Mom. Then they have they have a couple different ones that I wasn't, you know, wasn't too, uh, too smitten with. But I love the love, uh, I love those kind of um wine glasses and then these Mr. and Mrs. and inside it's gold I can't get enough of these these are absolutely fabulous absolutely fabulous so I love these and they're, they're very generous size too I bought these before but I bought two more of them because I, I wanted four. At Big Lots one year, my uh, friend, my former mother-in-law and I were out. And I found some stemmed wine glasses that were this iridescent glass. And there was four or six in a set. And I think a couple of them were broke. It was the last set they had. So I got a discount on them and I got them. So I had four. Out of the set, I had four. And then I saw these on Timu. These are billed as stemless wine, but they're, they're more of a rocks glass. You know, you could use them for wine, I guess, but they're more of a rocks glass. And I had ordered two before to see what they look like, and I like them, so I got two more. So now I have four stemmed and four rocks with this iridescent glass. So I, I really like these. These are really pretty. Very, they're very fast. You know, you can use them for every day. Or you can use them for holidays, special occasions. That's what I like about them. They're fancy enough to use, you know, for special occasions. But they're they're practical for every day, too. And that's kind of what I'm finding myself, surrounding myself with these days. I got this. Now, they have several of these. And I've bought something similar before. But, I can't. I, again, I can't, I can't get enough of these. This is a crystal... Um, that you'd hang in your window and it is this is actually glass it, it's not it's not acrylic it's glass so there's a good weight to it these are glass beads and then this one's on a chain 
and then it has um, you know a round thing that you can hang it but I love this it casts rainbows they're not expensive there's all kinds of different this one's a like a teardrop but there's all kinds of different you know kinds of charms on the end you know fobs or whatever you want to call it and on Erin's channel hey everybody I saw her she hauled a uh, rain cloud in a in glass and I immediately went and found one too because I'm I'm a pluviophile completely I love the rain and this just makes me happy <laughs> it's just a rain cloud and it's in it's etched inside this glass cube and I love it. I absolutely love it. There's there's so many of these on Timu, so many with all different things etched in them. And I I know back in the 90s these were a big thing and paperweights, you know, you could get them uh, personalized engraved, you know, with somebody's name on them. You know, there there's uh, different pet breeds, dog breeds and cats and and uh, different sports that you could, you know, you could get, you, you know, and they're just, they're just fun. And I just, I just love this rain cloud. It makes me happy. They have them with storms in them that look how, look how fluffy that cloud looks. Look how they etched that to where it looks so fluffy. <laughs> I love it. And in my holiday haul coming up, I've got one, another one I want to show you. And it's really, it's really cool too. Now this little thing is a little practical. I, I, <laughs> I was fascinated by this. It comes in this little box, and there's different colors that you can get. But look at this. Okay, so you get this little part here, and this is a magnet, and it's silicone. This little part is also a magnet, and it's silicone. Now, say you have a olive oil bottle that you need to wash. You can put this down in the bottle and then grab it on the other side of the glass with this and clean it. Isn't that something, if you can't get down into something, I know, you know, I've had my days of taking a case knife and putting a dish rag around it and sticking the case knife down in there and trying to get in the corners and everything. And I thought, well, that's a handy dandy little, little gadget there and I'm anxious to try it. So you just put this on the inside and then this on the outside of the glass and you just rub it like this because it sticks, it's magnet. I mean... I don't know if it works, but we're going to see. I just think that's that's cute if it works. And then I also got this silicone, silicone scraper. It says it's good for cat hair. It's also good for, I'm going to keep it in the car, to clean the condensation off of your car windows. And then you just wipe it off. But it says it, it removes cat hair, and it's on all three sides. The silicone's on all three sides, so you can just scrape one side and then scrape one side and... You know, so just just some little something to try. I'm, I'm going to try that. Okay, let me show you um, a, a few pieces of jewelry that I've got. And like I said, I'm not going to keep all of these because for once they were bigger than what I thought they would be. And they're almost to the point where, the, well, they are too big for me. So some of them are anyway. But I got this little uh, thing I needed to meet a threshold, and so I got this. It's a piece of elastic with buttonholes in it. It's got a button on it, and you can put it on your jeans to um, give you more room where it button, where they button up. Because sometimes we need a little bit more room, <laughs> especially if you're carrying fluid. You know what I mean? Okay, let me show you this this jewelry. Now I've got I've still got them in the packages because I you know I'll. What I'm planning on doing is just putting them all together and then taking them at Christmas for my nieces to just go through and take what they want. Because um, I've got several several pair like that that I, I just know I'm not going to wear. But this is the first pair. And, I, I you know, like I said, they're just bigger than I thought they were, so they're just too big for me. But they're really pretty. They've got, like, a little plastic. It looks almost like Mother of Pearl. And then they're, um, you know, if you've got, the hair to support that <laughs> they, they would they would look really cute but they're just they're just way too big for me they hang way too low that's it's more of a young person thing or you know if you are a, 
a hip grandma, you can definitely pull them off. I'm definitely not. <laughs> I don't fall into that category. I'm not even a grandma yet. You know, I'm like tell my kids you need to get on it. Now these I do like. These, um, I don't know if they're going to be too big or not. But they, th these are like, they're a gunmetal color and they've got this little mesh in them. This is mesh. They're really pretty. I don't know. I might have to try these with my hair and see what they look like because they're not they're not that big, and the the, cla the backings like this you have to put it down in in the hole when you put it on your ear. But yeah, this is pretty. There's different. Uh, I think these come in gold, silver, and gunmetal. They might come in black. I'm not sure, but I like I like these. Then I have this pair. Thought they would be smaller. Again, they're way too big for me. My taste, but they're really pretty. They're wooden. They're very boho looking. They're actually they're wood. See? But yeah, they're just that's that's way too much. <laughs> but they're pretty. Like I said, if you can pull it off. Yeah, they're cute. I'll put these back in these little bags so that I can have them ready to give to my girls. This is another pair that are too big for me, but they're pretty. This is just a silver, they're silver hoop, but they've got two wires on each side of this twisted part that goes in there and then they kind of just twist around really pretty really pretty you know i always wished i you know was that girl that who could pull off a, a big hoop but I, I just i just never was <laughs> but they're they're very pretty yeah that's bessie may you hear out there she's fussing at something These, I think I also got these in gunmetal, and wow, I mean just wow, honestly, wow, look, yeah, <laughs> that's definitely something there, they're pretty, they're pretty, I, li I like the design in them, but goodness gracious, I'm just, you know, if I wear something like this, I would get something stuck. It's sure as I'm sitting here, a scarf, or I would get, get my shirt collar stuck in them, and I would pull my ear off. I know. I know me. I know this. This would happen. But they are pretty. And then one more pair that I thought were beautiful, but again, these are like vinyl it's cut they're cut vinyl but they don't look like vinyl i don't think but they're these leaves look they're just vinyl look see and there's three three leaves they dangle really pretty this layered really pretty so they're going to have fun with these that they, they they could pull these off definitely and that'll be something fun for them to do you know and the last thing no best for last this time but i have unless i forgot something no i didn't forget anything but i bought um if you didn't know timu has these extenders that you can buy to make your necklaces longer and I got a pack that has the gold and the silver in them. So, very inexpensive. And this, um, this I bought several necklaces that won't go around. You know, they're too tight. And now I'll be able to wear them. Thanks to these. So that's what I have for you. I hope you saw something that you liked. And I will be back very soon with another Timu haul. And I've got a couple of other things that are interesting that I'd like to review for you and show you. So stay tuned for that. And until I see you again, have a wonderful fall day.
and happy shopping.